What's up guys, today I'm gonna talk about pullback from screen transition using Adobe Premiere Pro. Let's roll out the intro. Welcome back, Ravinder Josie here. Well, you can use this as a transition between two videos or you can use it as an effect within the video. Before we go any further, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let's get started. Open the video editing tool like Adobe Premiere Pro. Click on File Import or double click on the project to import all the media files. Now drag and drop the video files that are to be edited. Point the camera towards the display and then move the camera backwards. Turn the camera around so that it is facing you. The movement backwards should be slow and then the turn should be abrupt. Import this media file to the Premiere Pro. Match the frame in the second video to that of the frame in the first video so that there is continuity while editing. Use the razor tool to crop on both the sides of the video and the audio. Once you use the razor tool and select the file that is to be deleted, right click on it and click on clear or ripple delete to remove the audio or the video from a clip. Right click on that clip and then select unlink. Now there is no attachment between the audio and video. You can move the audio and video as per your need. Now that you have cropped the second clip, right click on this video and select speed or duration. Increase the speed to two and a half times so that or two times depending on how fast you want it to be. You might want to add sound effects during the transition or effect. To do this, go to YouTube audio library, download this music file, import it to Premiere Pro and add it under this video. So this is the last step in the transition or effect. So here is the clip. Now I'll add intro to this and the rest of the videos. So that's it guys. So this is how you do the transition. Hope you like this video. If you would like to see more videos of this kind, then don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.